hello guys my name is arsalan welcome back to my channel and today we guys are going to solve a new lead code question that is maximum number of pairs in array we will be solving this question with the help of python so just before starting to solve this question guys do subscribe to the channel hit the like button press the bell icon button and bookmark the playlist so that you can get the updates from the channel so Let's read out the question. You are given a, a zero index integer array nums. In one operation, you may do the following. Choose two integers. Choose two in integers in nums that are equal. So we have to choose two integers that are equal. Like 1, 1, 3, 3, 2, 2, they are equal. Remove both the integers from nums forming a pair. So we have to remove the pairs. Like 1, 1, we have to remove 3, 3, we have to remove 2, 2, we have to remove. And then we have to, the, the operation is done on nums as many times as possible. So this operation can be done as many times as possible if these two conditions are met meaning that they are equal uh, there are equal number of pairs so we can just remove them as number uh, times so after remove the, removing them return a zero index integer array answer of size 2 where answer 0 is the is the number of pairs that are formed and answer 1 is the number of leftover integer nums after doing the operation as many times as possible so basically what they are saying here is if you haven't understood it let me explain it to you what they are saying that we have to remove them it's this we can remove this way the pair we have to remove and we have to include the number of pair counts here for example their count 1 1 is the count will be one then two two the count will be two three three will be count three uh, but uh, after removing all these three all these uh, three pairs uh, we can we have to increase the count of three here and if you can see there is one left over here that is two which, which do not have any pair so for that we have to uh, include that left over here so uh, if you guys have understood this uh, example with example i hope you have understood it with the example and if you haven't let's uh, check for example number two that uh, there are one one so the <coughs> the pair uh, frequency is one and there is no leftover so we will just return zero here so here also there is only zero so zero and leftover is one let's start solving this question out in the coding section and uh, first of all i will be just creating our c here and i will just use the python built-in function that is collections dot counter nums and uh, if i return this value for you and show it to you what exactly this means is that it will give me the counting of in a dictionary so uh, it will give me frequency table diagram meaning that uh, how many threes are there how many twos are there how many ones are there in a dictionary form so sh let me show it to you see uh, it's giving me one two oh sorry one three two so how, what what is giving it's giving one count two count three count uh, like uh, there is one uh, one and two three and uh, uh, three two so this was in the collections counter and if you have still not have any i have not understood it collections dot counter please you can google it and this is collections dot counter let's now create our another let's create our another uh, variable here that is our result is equal to an empty uh, sorry not an empty it should consist of zero zero which would be first at zero at index it will be counting as uh, my it will be counting my uh, frequency of the pairs and second will be counting my leftovers and uh, for that i will just create
meaning that if the all in the question.